Welcome to the Christ in Us devotional. Today's devotional is titled, Raised with Christ. Therefore we were buried with Him through baptism into death, that just as Christ was raised from the dead by the glory of the Father, even so we also should walk in newness of life. For if we have been united together in the likeness of His death, certainly we also shall be in the likeness of His resurrection. Romans chapter 6, verses 4 through 5. It is a beautiful truth that Christ's death and resurrection are ours too. This one all-encompassing truth is the very essence of our salvation. Romans chapter 10, verses 9 through 10 states, that if you confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in your heart that God has raised Him from the dead, you will be saved. For with the heart one believes unto righteousness, and with the mouth confession is made unto salvation. Our belief and confession in the resurrection of Christ bring God's power and transformation so we can walk in the newness of life. Our glorious position in Christ is revealed in Ephesians chapter 2, verses 4 through 7. But God, who is rich in mercy, because of His great love with which He loved us, even when we were dead in trespasses, made us alive together with Christ, by grace you have been saved, and raised us up together, and made us sit together in the heavenly places in Christ Jesus, that in the ages to come He might show the exceeding riches of His grace in His kindness toward us in Christ Jesus. The enemy will attack us by flooding our minds with doubts and lies about who we are in Christ. Paul tells us in Colossians chapter 3, verses 1-2, through 2, If then you were raised with Christ, seek those things which are above where Christ is, sitting at the right hand of God. Set your mind on things above, not on things on the earth. It is important to meditate on these scriptures and walk in faith, believing that Christ has raised us up with Himself, and we are now in the Spirit with Him, and one day soon we will be glorified with Him, and our bodies will be changed, and we will be like Him. See 1 John chapter 3, verses 1-3. through 3. Philippians chapter 3 verses 20 through 21. We must settle it now. If you have confessed Christ and believe He was raised from the dead, then you are saved and are raised with Christ. Rise above the things of this world and seek the heavenly treasures in Christ. Declare aloud that you belong to Christ and sit with Him in the heavenly places. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, thank You for Your glorious salvation in Christ. Thank you for saving and raising me with Christ in the heavenly places. I pray that when the enemy comes to discourage me and speaks lies to me, I will rise up in faith and declare your truth that I am raised with Christ and have the power to walk in the newness of life. Amen. If you have listened to this devotional but have never repented and asked the Lord to come into your life and would like to do so now, pray this. Heavenly Father, I believe the Lord Jesus died and was raised from the dead according to the Scriptures. I come to you asking for you to forgive me and wash me of all my sins. Please cleanse me from all things that are offensive to you. Please do a work in me according to your will so that I may be with you forever when I die. Teach me your ways and the things that please you. Amen. If you have prayed this, please let us know in the comments. I encourage you to ask the Heavenly Father to guide you to a church where you can be baptized in water and can be taught and grow in the Lord. Seek the Lord Jesus and ask Him to baptize you in the Holy Spirit. God bless you.